You seem sad, stranger. I heard you mention a flood. I'd explain it by playing for you if I could, but its pipes are deep under the water now. A flood without rain. That is strange. Where is this place? I'll have a look if I'm in the Just area. Just northwest of here. Look all you like, but I don't see what good it'll do. The flood waters aren't going anywhere. How does one ask a river to relent? This must be the ruin Laolai was talking about. Deep in. Flooded too, as she said. Snap eyes. Probably came from somewhere over there. Somebody wanted in. Nearly blew this entire ledge off just to get through the door. Flooding detected. Evacuation recommended. Overflow basin compromised. The overflow basin. Is that the dent? Looks like a control center. What happened? Intake tower malfunction. Drainage system. Looks like most of the facility is underwater. What is happening? Another holographic interface. The lock positions. Helpful. been through here. Not that long ago either. You just made me. <laughs> For a moment, I thought my fire was snuffed. My forge gone cold. But nope, nope. Not old Gildan. You're welcome. Uh, wait. Start from the beginning. What are you doing down here? Ow! My apologies. <laughs> When you mostly talk to yourself, you can tell your stories in whatever order you like. There's an artifact in that storage room I simply must acquire. But as you may have noticed, the door won't budge. I took one of those roundish, ringy what's-its from the wall beside the door. No luck. So I had to go at that panel with the button. Even less luck. My gentle experimentation caused the chamber to... Flood. So I push the button again, perhaps a little too enthusiastically. Sparks and smoke. <laughs> now, obviously, I came here to investigate. My cautious footsteps may have contributed slightly to the collapse of a bridge. And when the bridge began to collapse, I may have, for the sake of expedience, abandoned the cumbersome ringy what's it to the waves. And by the time I thought to give up the endeavor, the door had closed behind me. And thusly do we come 
to the present moment. So, we need to replace that ring and get into the storage room. Then I can fix the panel and shut this place down. And I can finally wrap my fingers around that looking glass. Okay, Gildan. How are we gonna get that ring? Two sets of hands, girl! Two sets of hands! Behind us lie a pair of enormous gates, but I believe the gates must be operated in tandem. Together, we can dry this place out. Guess we better get started, then. I guess we better. Up ahead, girl. See the valve? Time to put our hands to use. I'll take care of this one. There's another valve on the other side to lock the gate in place. Would you mind heading across and uh, doing the honor? You know, I'm reminded of a tell by on the out here. So look, how You made it! Now grab that valve and give it a spin! On it. A little more now, and I should be able to get the blasted gate moving! There. You should be able to lower the gate. Huh? Right you are! Now, when I get this gate down, you'll need to turn the valve again. i to lock this thing in place! can depend on it to take you exactly where you need to go, and no further. Hmm. I'd wager the valves for the second sluice gate are somewhere above us. How are we gonna get up there? Let me look around, see what I can find. Probably needed the wash. Okay, Gildan, turn the valve. It's not working. I need to get up higher. Would climb up that wreckage. That's pretty much what I do.
Going down. Dead. <laughs> Marvelous. So, the uh, ring. Maybe if you pry its jaws open and reach inside, I can't look. You were right. This thing did swallow the ring. Ha <laughs> ha! That's the old gilded intuition in action. It's never led me astray. Sure, its chosen routes can be a bit circuitous, but never mind. To the storage room! To the spoils! I can't wait, I can't wait! Almost there! Soon I'll hold the looking glass in my hand. Just like Mum and I used to.
<laughs> I can't believe that works. That's too bad to mind, tickling the empty air like that. Gildan? Everything okay? I was so sure I saw it. The looking glass. I... Looking glass? My... I'm so sure. My old mom found one for me when I was... It was one of the last things she... I was sure I saw it. Right there in the window. I would... Of course. Trick of the light. Nothing at all. It's fine. Uh, I'm fine. Besides, what are the spoils and compared what a to the Dell? Was that's oh. why we do it, girl. Great blazing forge. I'll <laughs> never Dell. forget that. Not the treasure. <laughs> now then, I uh, believe we have some repairs to make. Prettier, isn't it? <laughs> what does it mean? It means it worked. By the forge! Ah! You are a wonder! Do you hear that often? I'll hazard a guess you do. I've heard something like that once or twice. Oh, she's modest now. A master of the arts of the old ones, a delver to shame the entire claim, and she wants to be modest. Ah! It's... Not like I did it alone, Gildan. No. No, I suppose not. So what's next for you? On your way back to the claim? And deprive the people of Song's Edge the story of this encounter? Perish the thought! <laughs> I'll stay there a while longer. But a story is best told by all who encountered it. Come and lend a hand, won't you? Overflow basin empty. Interior accessible. Minimal flood damage. Sounds like the basin is dried out too. Maybe I'll take a look. Another adventure, Selfie! <laughs> Braver than me. Oh, there was no question of that. <laughs> Kidding about the sound. Must be an entrance to this thing. What you did, but the water drained in the snap of a short song. What do you think of the music? I've never heard anything else like it. 
That's because there's no other place with such resonance, such intonation that rattles your ribs with its power. And of course, no one else knows these pipes like I do. I learned them by ear before I could walk, strapped to my father's back. Thank you for draining the waters, not just for myself, but for my ancestors and their songs. Please, take this as a token of our gratitude. Outland. It would be my... I've heard of you, Antris. Each of the many verses of your song tells of an impossible victory. The notes echo across the cut. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. That I know. My song used to echo around Banur. Omnak, the hunter of legendary machines. That's why I'm here. For another. They call it the Claws Beneath. Or they did when I was younger. Its defeat would have given my song a fine end. Oh, yeah. I used to travel between Banur and the Cut without stopping to sleep. But this trip... My bones ache, Huntress. But you... Out hunting Aratak. Leading your own Werak. If half your song is true, you are the only hunter I trust to go in my place. You want me to hunt for you? Not just for me, no. For an old friend. This is obviously important to you, Unak. Are you sure you want someone else to take down this machine? No, I am no longer a match for the claws beneath. If I ever was. If I face it, it will kill me. Of this I have no doubt. The Banuk blood in my veins screams at me to take on the claws myself. But I must see it brought down. And dead men see precious little. A friend of mine. He died while we hunted the claws beneath. Many, many years ago. Would spilling my blood on his grave make him happy? Would it bring him peace? It seems unlikely. All right, Umnok. I'll do what I can. I've no doubt you can do quite a lot. The stories say the Claws Beneath returns here only once every six winters. The whispers I've heard say it now makes its home on the northeast edge of the cut. Hunt well. Even if I care to travel south. Spotted. There you are. Just like Umnok said. over. It wasn't easy, but that rock breaker won't be hurting anyone anymore. The claws beneath brought low by an outlander. <laughs> this part of your song will travel far. I don't know if I'll ever get used to that. I've found people rarely live up to their songs. You're an exception, though. And you've done me a true kindness. My foe is buried now, like so many of the hunters it killed. My friend, my chieftain, 
He would be pleased to know his fate won't befall anyone else. Take this in thanks. I believe you've more than earned it. Pontiff's impulsive ignorance could have sparked another war. Let him freeze for what he's done. You're Aloy, right? My pop... Burgund, I mean, told me you might be heading up to see me. Varja. Pleasure. Hey, that spear is really something. You've customized her, haven't you? I've made a change or two. You've got an I wish these there. Banuk agreed with you. I can't seem to sell scrap to a Glen talk around here. Everyone wants boring old bows and spears. I like the more unusual stuff. And the Banuk can get unusual. Like that spear Aratok hauls around? An ice ray. Ooh, or that weapon of Araya's? What I wouldn't give to poke around inside one of those. Feel the lightning on my fingers. Or inside of anything, really. Last commission I had was a month ago. A weapon that spat fire. That didn't go well. I've got a nice rail, just like our talks. You want to take a look? Uh, are you serious? Y yes, yes, I'd love that. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Obvious design flaw. So if I replace these... Yeah, that should... <sighs> right. So, believe it or not, she's operating at... Let's be generous. Half her potential. What's with the she's? <laughs> oh. Pop says all weapons are girls. I don't think he realizes it's a compliment. Uh, well, listen. If we had a Thunderjaw's mandibles to work with, her gears would be well and truly greased. And I know where to find one, if you want to go hunting with me. Remind me what we need to fix up this thing? That Thunderjaw's mandibles will do it. So, let's say someone you know happened to have a weapon like Araya's. You Seek don't. Yourself. Of course. Look at the... So the coils generate the spark, but the power source isn't even bolted in. I won't lie, she's beautiful. But there's beautiful and then there's beautiful. What we need is a Stormbird Talon. Lightning flows over them like water off a goose. And I know where one is. Hunt it with me, I'll turn that weapon into your new best friend. And second best. A weapon that spits flame, huh? Like this one? I took this thing off an Osaron bandit. Think you could do anything with it? <laughs> you got my forge fire back? Well, if you took down Olgrid and his goons for this thing, I guess she's yours now. Why don't you finish it for me first? Make it... make her into the weapon she was supposed to be. Thought you'd never ask. I'm gonna need a bellowback snout. Any bellowbacks will do. Can you handle it alone? I think I can manage that. So we need parts from a Stormbird and a Thunderjaw? And you know where to find them. That's right. It's gonna take some traveling, though. We can find a Thunderjaw out in the Valley Meet, and a Stormbird Roost near the Free Heat. I'll pack and meet you out there. This will be fun. Okay. That should do it. Varja can finish her forge fire now.
Barger said she could improve the storm cell on this. Time to rain down some pain. Got that part you need. Perfect. Already got machine oil on my hands. Here it is. One Stormbird Talon. Let's do it. I haven't had this much fun in ages. Watch and learn, Aloy. Only, don't stare directly at the sparks. <clears throat> okay, so I pretty much had to break her in half. But what's a staff? A stick. One thing I like about sticks, you can put them back together however you want. Which you did. This thing looks a whole lot more dangerous. She's better than dangerous. She's a genuine Varja special now. Take good care of her. I've got what you asked for. Show me what you had in mind for the forge fire. Finally! Was feeling like I neglected her. And that's a little too close to my family life. She's done and she's yours. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. That looks great. I almost expected you to turn it into a burning rope caster or something. Nah, she was close to perfect from the start. She's a Varja original, after all. Okay, Varja, let's move on. You don't want to catch some of that Karja sun? Nah, you're right. Fired up? Sure feels good to be out of knee-deep snow. So, we've got a thunder drop. I'm ready to do this. On your lead. Scrabbling a bit. Marja should be able to fix up the ice rail. Found the part. Ready to fix up that weapon? I am always ready to fix up a weapon. Never thought I'd be glad to see the inside of a Thunderjaw's mouth. I sure am. Every machine's a big box of tools. Once they stop trying to kill you, then. Trust me, Aloy. You won't... There. Oh, she's perfect. A spear's a spear, right? Poke slash done. Boring. I adjusted the chill water flow, rebalanced here, strapped on a launcher, and now she shoots freezing spikes. You weren't kidding. More beautiful, more powerful. That's Thanks, my Marja. guarantee. These three weapons are fine work. <laughs> 